Hey guys, welcome back to Strawberry Spills the Tea. And today, the tea is about me. <laughs> it's really been tough, guys. You have no idea the trauma that I've been going through. Cinnamon has been completely ignoring me. And to be honest, it's not so much that I care about her being my friend, but I need that. You know what I mean? Like, I need her friendship because it's the only way I'm going to get to the top at the school. But now it seems like... I'm just at the bottom. <laughs> we just had gym class and she like took away my cheerleading outfit. It's really hard for me to talk about this, guys. I am no longer a cheerleader at BBH. I know. First of all, the cheer team's gonna suck. Second of all, the cheer team is now ugly because I was what was keeping up the hotness. <laughs> now I just don't know what to do with my life. Like, if I am not a cheerleader at this school, what is my work? You know what I mean? <laughs> then we're like, I'm crying, guys. I swear. I just, like, don't have tears. I don't produce them. It's really tough. And now Cinnamon's having this party, and she's not even inviting me. Even Rhea and Tootsie are invited. This is the first time they've ever been invited to one of her parties. I know she did this to get mad at me. And it's working. Anyways, I have English now. I don't even know why I'm going. It's not like I can pay attention to anything else because my life is literally so sucky. I'm just gonna go home. I, I just can't be here. It's just too many bad vibes. I need a green juice. Anyways, talk to you guys later. I'm not paying a dollar for water. Are you kidding me? You get that stuff for free in like the ocean. Give me it. Strawberry, we have English. We have a presentation. Come. No, you have to do this presentation by yourself, Raja. I am going through a lot. Why are you looking at me like that? You don't even know. Okay, you don't know the trauma that I'm going through. I'm going home. Hey guys, Strawberry here. I'm currently taking a break because I was on a jog just because I needed to like air out my frustration and the only way I can ever air out my frustration and take out all my stress is when I run because running makes me feel super skinny and super healthy even just saying those words I get happy but I'm not happy I'm really sad it's just really really tough so yeah i just ran five miles i know i'm so so fit and i'm just like sitting on the bleachers because i saw five girls hanging out and they were all cheerleaders from another school and i just like realized that's not me anymore i just who am I? Crying over there. She's not even invited to Cinnamon's party. Samantha, leave me alone. Whatever, you're not a cheerleader anymore. I will be. Don't remind me. You're not even a cheerleader anymore. Your outfit's really tight on me. Gladys, that is supposed to be on me, not on you. Leave. Wait, can you make Bye, me cheer? Ah, I was gonna ask if you can make me cheerleader. <laughs> I need to go on a jog, guys. I'm going on a jog. I can't. No, this way. I need to go on a jog. I need to run some more. I need to run some more. <laughs> oh, guys. There are some really cute boys over there. Okay. Let's see if Strom still got it. Let me show you how it's done, guys. Oh, I can't do this on camera because it's really hard. I end, I might end up showing my tatas, so BRB. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, look at her tight body, yaddy, yaddy. Hey, boys, come help Strob stretch out her hamstrings. Oh, and guys, the hot one's calling me over. BRB, guys. Good morning, my berries. It's a beautiful day. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling so much better than I did yesterday. Let me tell you that. 
Basically, after my jog, I came home and was like super frustrated. And when I came home, I was like letting all my anger out. And Raja came over and then he like basically gave me the idea of apologizing to Cinnamon. And at first I was like, are you crazy? But then he made a good point because I was like, wait a second, if I apologize, then her... Then her and I will be friends again, and I can, like, totally be back on track to ruining her life and becoming queen. Me. Queen. Can you imagine? Obby. So then I went to her party, and I apologized. She forgave me, obviously, because she's stupid. And now we're friends again. And the reason my makeup is still on is because I basically came home. I changed into my PJs, as you can see. Oh, look at her tight body. She's been working out a lot. And I put on my pajamas, and then, like, I was still, like, so excited that I tired myself out. And I just, like, passed out, you know, like, on my bed. So that's why my makeup's still on. But that's okay, because I still look so cute. So I'm not even gonna wash this off. I'm gonna enjoy my day with this makeup look. <laughs> yes, I am cutie patootie. Anyways, guys, let me know. If you guys think that I'm a queen, and if you don't think so, then you can go home, okay? Anyways, love you very so, so much. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe. And, um, yeah, love you guys. It's such a good day today. Back on track to being popular. Bye.